Two people charged with animal cruelty after more than 20 neglected dogs were rescued from their home in Clarksville. And now those dogs are at a local shelter, which is now overcrowded. New at 10, News Channel 5's Emily Luxon explains how you can help. It's a familiar scene at Montgomery County Animal Care and Control. Every kennel filled with a dog looking for a forever home. Daily, we operate at full capacity. Um, e even though we do have people come in that are reclaiming pets, um, we have one pet go out the door and we have another one come in. But this week, when 22 dogs came in at once after an animal cruelty investigation, Director Dave Kasky says the staff at the shelter was forced to get creative. We did have to do some moving around and we were in contact with local rescues, um, other animal shelters. Additional kennels were moved into hallways and every inch of space is being used. The dogs were all examined by a veterinarian and will stay at the shelter until the investigation is complete. Kasky says the building only has enough room to house 45 dogs, so the new additions put a strain on resources. It's really put our staff in a real bind. It's uh, set them back on their daily routines. People here at the shelter say this case is a reminder of why they need a larger facility. We are just running at full capacity at all times and it, all it takes is one small incident for us to go over capacity. To help alleviate overcrowding, Kasky is asking people to consider adopting dogs like Marble, who is ready to meet his new family. If they could come in if they're looking or in the market for a new pet to please come to our shelter, uh, see if there's something here that they can give a good home to. <laughs> With dogs of all shapes and sizes to choose from, with the community's help, employees hope these kennels will be empty soon. In Clarksville, Emily Luxon, News Channel 5. Thanks, Emily. If you're interested in adopting a dog, the shelter is open tomorrow starting at 10 in the morning, and we have more information under this story on newschannel5.com.